Good morning. It's January 15th. We're taking a look at guncalendars.com where we try to archive our Second Amendment history. And today we have the anniversary of the passing of another firearms inventor. This time it's half of Smith & Wesson. Horace Smith died today back in 1893. Now I'm not an expert. I've only uh, done a bit of research creating the uh, firearms inventors deck, but going through and looking at Horace Smith's life, it's seems interesting. He started out in the armory, U.S. Armory, inventing for them, and he, I guess, invented a bullet that was explosive that could was used to kill whales. Then he teamed up with Wesson, Dan Wesson's brother, so the other Wesson, and uh, started Smith and & Wesson, and they first started with, of course, uh, the Volcanic, a lever-action right uh, firearm that used the volcanic cartridge which had a uh, its propellant in the lead projectile which uh, was anemic and didn't catch on but then uh, you know went on to become Winchester and the lever action rifles uh, he and Wesson of course created the second version of the Smith and Wesson company created the uh, the cartridge, this 22 short, the first cartridge, the right, the revolver that wrapped around it, and the rest is is pretty well known to history. What's also interesting about S Smith is that he sold his part of the company to Wesson at age 65 and lived 28 more years uh, as a retired guy. So uh, that's unusual for the firearms inventors. Most of them don't just cash out and enjoy the rest of their lives. So many of them uh, keel over while they're still inventing. So it's been interesting. I don't know much more about this guy, but uh, it's one of the reasons we do the, the focus on our 2A history is for an opportunity to learn more. So if you are able to uh, add to it, let us know in the comments to the, to the story of, of Smith. But uh, this is the anniversary of his passing. This kind of stuff we take a look at over at guncalendars.com. Let us know in the comments what you think. And as always, thanks for watching.